are heading to Michigan. Karma decided. We do not know where to go. So we're gonna have Karma decide for us. She's drooling on my arm. I guess the squirrel will be up through Michigan, yeah. UP, and then over to South Dakota. The bone will be straight across to like Badland, South Dakota. Yeah. Let's see which one she picks. Which will you choose? We're going to Michigan. <laughs> We're going to Michigan. <laughs> we just stopped at a rest stop. And it's a really nice lady that I met in the bathroom. She gave us these freshly baked pitas, a whole, whole thing of them that sure she just picked yeah. up in Cleveland, Ohio. They are delish. We're going to Crack Barrel again. North of Flint. North and then Flint. tomorrow we're hitting Christmas World. Yeah. We don't even like Christmas, but we're going. It's the largest. I don't know. You guys will see tomorrow. <laughs> we missed it. We just missed the Michigan side. This is the first time that all three of us have been to Michigan. Yeah. Our GPS just took us off the interstate and brought us on a dirt road. In Ann Arbor, Michigan. Apparently it's faster. Where the heck are we? Natural beauty road. <laughs> Hello, we made it to Bridgeport, Michigan. Um, I, I was trying to be frugal and we got off like, I don't know, 15 minutes before the exit for the Cracker Barrel because I thought the gas was 338, but we got there and it was like 367 or something. We just got to the Cracker Barrel and gas here is like 334. We are making, or trying to make some corn dip. We're going to our new and improved cutting station. working with. We have made it to Christmas Wonderland, the largest Christmas store in the world. This is overwhelming, but I found the dog picture. There's so much stuff. Oh man, we found the Christmas ornament that beats all Christmas ornament. Beans and wieners. Look at the chandelier. We found the princess section. This place is so giant. This is crazy. Dinosaur. Yeah. I bought vehicles that cost less than this Christmas tree. It's a nice tree though. Wow. $100. Wow. That is wild. For us, four hundred dollars. Well, that's a red one. Seems kind of cool. That is kind of cool. I can't believe that fake trees are so expensive. for an orange one. It's a Halloween one. That was one. <laughs> that's kind of cool. Wow, that one's crazy up there. Are you overwhelmed? That was overwhelming. Because I'm overwhelmed. And now I need a nap. Now it's raining too. Wow. That was crazy. That was insane. I'm not even a Christmas person and that was just like... <laughs> I think you've said that like 10 times. Wow. Like I need to make sure that people know. I, I anti-Christmas. <laughs> we have made it to the Mackinac Bridge in Michigan. And look at the swarm. I don't know if you guys can see them. But they are all over me and all over the van. Wow. <gasps> what is that? Cool. Oh, there my mouth. I've never seen a hatch like this before. All over his back. We have entered the bridge. This is the fifth largest suspension bridge. We're actually on the phone with my dad and he took a picture of us from the live cam that he's watching of the bridge. 
Wow, this is crazy. Wow, this whole bridge is a great. Wow, it's like dragging us around. So there's a four dollar toll to use the bridge. We're going through it right now. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Good, thank you. Thank you're you. Set. Have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Too. Whoa, look. Michigan's Upper Peninsula. These are all sand dunes. And this is Lake Michigan. It's huge. It's like the ocean. It's so blue though. Who knew this was the UP? So we just stopped and tried to get gas because we have the Gas Buddy app in the card. So we were supposed to get like 10 cents off. And we tried to get gas at the pump. But the pumps aren't working. Yeah, the pumps say site is paused or something, so we assume that the pumps are just off. So we're hoping there's another gas station around. We just got gas for 364 a gallon. Good thing we found another gas station down the road. And they have a window cleaner. You're doing a great job. Good morning from the shores of Lake Superior. We uh, drove around Pictured Rocks <laughs> um, National Shoreline last night. In the we, dark. Yep, we started at the eastern side and drove all the way to Menissing. I think I'm saying it right. I don't know. We should have just started here. We saw the northern lights last night. I slept most of the time. Yeah. But, um, so that's why we didn't get anything filmed. But now, now we're going to go try... Pasties. I thought it was pasties. Some, I thought it was pasties, but they're pasties. And I guess they're huge in the UP. They're like little hand pies. But also, I'm kind of bummed because all of these bo are, um, bottom tours. <laughs> Glass bottom shipwreck tours. <laughs> All of the, the boat tours that you see, the cool rocks and stuff and pictured rocks, um, they're all closed until next week. So yeah, we came we're a little a week bit early. too early here. We're a little bit early. Okay, let's go eat. Okay, this is what it looks like. I haven't opened it yet. We got, got beef gravy. Whoa, it's like a hamburger pie thing. Wow. Wow. So these That's huge. These have what? Ground beef. Um, uh, potatoes, rutabaga, onions. Some stuff. It's like a pie, I think. This is supposed to be the best place in the UP. Apparently. Just dive into it. I just dropped almost it. almost lost it. Yeah, it's like a, a pie. Ooh. Like a meat pie. Yeah. Meat and potatoes. First impressions? Yeah. Pretty good? Good meat pie. Yeah. Hello from Munising Falls. Munising, we should have asked how you pronounce it. Munising. Munising? Munising Falls. Hello from Munising Falls. That's what I'm going to call it. We are in Pictured Rocks National Lakeshore. Karma's with us here. Special She's guest allowed. appearance. She is allowed on this trail. And here's the falls. It's pretty. Yeah, it's kind of just like a boardwalk. Yeah, it's a short little walk, but just kind of poking around, trying to visit some beaches. Carmo would like to welcome you all to Sandpoint Beach. It's really teal and windy. That's an island over there. And then there's a tiny, they're called light stations instead of lighthouses like in Maine. But we really picked the right week to be here. There's like nobody here. Karma is loving it. Check this out. You can see where it's really shallow, where it's really deep. Welcome to our lunch station in the van. What we we are happen? making eggy waffles. I will show you the process in a second. We're having more coffee. Mo coffee. Mm -hmm. That was bad. <laughs> Oops. Okay, we're gonna try a new method here. Cheese first, because the cheese did not stick. Oh, that might have been too much. Okay, let's see how what happens. 
Okay. Stay tuned. Not quite, but it's. I feel like it's there. better. Yeah. Egg steam is like right in my face. <laughs> Not a good facial. <laughs> I steam my face with eggs and cheese every day. <laughs> you too can achieve this look. <laughs> Come on, cheese. Didn't work either. Oh, not bad. She got peeled off. Not bad. This looks like a mess, but it's really good. I have the eggy waffle with mozzarella, some cabbage on top, just like coleslaw mix, sour cream, and taco sauce. Really good because I don't like eggs, so I just try to mask them. Mike's making one more before we go. He's cutting down the egg carton to save some space. We're the only ones here. <laughs> wow. Pretty. All right, I'm going to let you off since we're the only ones here. The only one here in this giant parking lot. This is the best time to be here. I think today is May 12th. This is our favorite so far, it's so funny. It says, do not bend over. Here's the pig. An average American worker, 2004. <laughs> Which it's still applicable in 2024. I'm pretty sure this is used to bring boats into Lake Superior. Not sure, but I'll confirm. <laughs> But we just walked this, the Coast Guard's down there. We thought this was a lighthouse, but I guess the lighthouse is over there. And not this breakwater that we've been walking on. We are currently trying to get to the northmost part of Michigan. This is what we've just come across. <laughs> Mike's trying to drain it. I just went out with my boots on. It's pretty deep. All right, we gave up on that giant puddle. And this is the spot for the night. Yeah, we're gonna need some levelers. <laughs> Everything's pink from the sand here. They're like giant Legos. Keep going. No one else is out here, which is kind of nice. Tomorrow, if the pond is drained, we're going to try to get out there. Come on, Karma. Come on. We're spending the night here. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Time for dinner in bed. By the way, we stopped at a truck shop. Shop. We stopped at a truck stop to shower on the way here, and we feel rejuvenated. We're new people. So rejuvenated. The van is such a disaster from driving on that road. Everything just kind of fell at once. All right, time for dinner. Good morning. We survived. We just packed up camp and now we're gonna drive down to where we couldn't pass last night because of the water, see if our work paid off and it drained out so we can get to the northernmost part of Michigan. Look at this. I took the window covering down this morning and we were just laying in bed and we saw a truck with a truck camper drive by, so they went through the puddle. Mm. 
He should have done it, but... He, he was bigger than us, though. Yeah, that's true. So, we'll see. No one's bigger than the van. Still pretty deep. Yeah, I think if I was to go down, I'd, like, hug this left side so that my passenger side tire was, like, where you are. We have made the decision to not go through the puddle because this is our home, not just a van. <laughs> we keep finding like this metal skid plate and then there's this plastic piece that's new from last night that got ripped off from someone's vehicle going through it. So we tried to ditch it out, which I wish someone else did this before us, but it took a while. I went down a lot, but I just walked out and there's some big rocks in the middle where the van would go. And also I wore my, my rubber boots like up to here and I got water in both boots. We're just going to fly the drone to see what it looks like from here. We're launching it from the solar panel. <laughs> I really like landing on top of the van. <laughs> Me too. The karma's like, what the heck was that bird? We might have just driven down a hiking trail. <laughs> Look at this. It's a little bit beyond our abilities. Here. Poke her out the window. It's a little rocky. I mean, we could try it now. No. <laughs> we get to back up a bit. really bad if we come across some hikers. Here's the star. <laughs> Little karma. Karma, how do you know this is a camera? Just look at it. Look at the camera. Oh, so cute. Little karma. We've settled on this spot for the night. Bayer Lake in the UP. Mike just made the bed. <laughs> You get a nice butt crack shot, shot of me? No, I missed it. <laughs> no. Hang on, I gotta turn the lights for you guys. That's not a very well made bed. It's okay. It's a it's a van bed, so. There's our bed. Karma's little sleeping bag. We got some sun. So, I'm gonna turn the heater on soon. Cheers. To that. <laughs> And tomorrow we're going to a Nordic spring at Mount Bohemia. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Hello, it's my birthday. And of course it's raining. The one day. Typical. It's been a high of 45 all week and tomorrow it's going to be like 76. And it's of course on my birthday raining. But we found a Nordic spa in like middle of nowhere upper peninsula in michigan now we're at mount bohemia baby yes yeah, so we're gonna go use that for my birthday because it's cold and rainy and there's nothing else going on and we're going to the gay bar in the town of gay yeah we are we're gonna get some gay drinks yeah some drinks <laughs> in gay but since it's raining and everything's outdoors i'm not gonna bring this camera that we film with so i'll try to record on my phone because less important yeah. <laughs> they're pretty good they're all of them bad it's really salty mm -hmm. Gotta go under. 
Good morning from the Gay Flat. From, it's actually called Gay Stamp Sands? Gay Stamp. We're Beach. in the town of Gay still. Yeah. Went to the Gay Bar last night. Had ourselves a great time. It was fun. Highly recommend that place. Oh, you have to go if you're in the UP. Yeah. Just make the trip. Yeah. They have great t-shirts, great drinks, great hospitality. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. We we just said by yeah. <laughs> we spent the night overlooking Lake Superior, and a super fun site. So that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna uh, brush my teeth in the van. Now we are on our way to some place. Not quite sure where. A different time zone. A different time zone. It doesn't matter that we um we're leaving at eleven forty two. Technically, it's ten forty two. That's right. Welcome to the beautiful black. I mean. <laughs> Mosquito Mountain or uh, Porcupine <laughs> <The porkies>. Mountains. <laughs> Man, it is buggy out here, but we are still in the UP. We found the state park. We got a little bullfrog down there. But we're doing this today. Can we go find some free camping because we're not paying for that. Pretty. That's pretty. Pretty small. <laughs> Those are the other overlooks, and it's just a boardwalk path. So we're just wearing Crocs, of course, crocking it. it. Not even in four-wheel drive. Good morning from the buggiest spot on earth, someplace in Michigan. There were so many mosquitoes last night. I thought they were gonna eat through the sheet metal of the van <laughs> and attack us. Luckily. It was so bad. Luckily, we'd turn the rooftop fan off and let them kind of accumulate up there and be like, oh, we want to get biting to They're me still. And then we'd turn the fan on and just... We murdered them. Yeah. There's still a lot, though. But man, the pollen here. Yeah. Take uh, my Costco. I feel bad. Aller clear. So many trilliums here. You can't see them like right around the van, but there's like a lot. So mm -hmm. that's cool. But for now, we're going to... A McDonald's to treat ourselves to some coffee and maybe a breakfast sandwich. Well, lunch now. <laughs> um, and then we're headed towards Minneapolis. I have my free breakfast and my free birthday thing. Oh yeah, Matea's getting free things at McDonald's. So right now we are in Wisconsin. We just did a quick drive through. Didn't do anything. It's a, a giant boat. morning from uh -oh. our last Cracker Barrel on uh, the road, probably for a while. Jeez, it's a sadness after no Cracker Barrel. We're watching a plane take off. We are in Sioux Falls. <laughs> Allergies are high. <laughs> and I'm so pale in this white sweatshirt. <laughs> <laughs> we are in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Yep, we've kind of jumped around because we've been just driving straight with yeah. nothing really going on. But today we're going to shower. <laughs> there wasn't a lot in in uh, Minnesota or Wisconsin for mm. that matter. So we just kind of breezed through there, uh, talked to some locals. Yeah, we're going to go to the YMCA today in Sioux Falls. $4 for shower, sauna, hot tub, whatever you need. We kind of try to head west, but it's supposed to be really rainy again tonight. So we can't really yeah. like go to, you know, like Badlands, deserty camping because we might not be able to get out. We'll figure it out. We always yeah. do. 